game is supposed to be rated one of the worst PlayStation games. Uh, the controls are pretty bad. Especially uh, considering you have to only use the D-stick. You can't, uh, there's no, the analog stick didn't exist when this came out, I don't think. And most 3D games, you use an analog stick. Even when Mario 64 came out around this time, you used an analog stick. The reason I've called you here today is to explain why a state of general emergency has been called by the woolly military. As you may already know, a great catastrophe has befallen us that threatens to destroy our very woolly way of life. Bubsy Bobcat! Bubsy Bobcat is on Rayon! Well, I'll be bumped! Settle down! Settle down! Calm down! No one's going to be bumped on my watch! How could this have happened? Well, that's a bit of a long story, but here's the abridged version, approved for public dispersal by their royal highnesses, Queens Polly and Esther. Our magnificent queens devised an ingenious plan to steal all the wool balls of Earth, but they were foiled by the fiendish Bubsy Bobcat. Now, our queens have developed an even more ingenious, if such a thing as possible, invasion plan. Unfortunately, they needed to get the furball out of the picture! So a crack troop of woolly commandos were sent to work. There, they fought bravely and captured the hideous beast! Do him no small part to my brilliant tactical leadership. On the return trip, uh, due to a slight technical difficulty, the rocket carrying the beast crashed and the Bobcat escaped! <gasps> now, if you see the Bobcat, do not, I repeat, do not approach it! It can be extremely dangerous when frightened by the average woolly! <sighs> Report its whereabouts immediately to the nearest woolly soldier. We have stationed nose blowers and rock throwers throughout the area around the crash site. <sighs> We anticipate having recaptured the creature in two shakes of a dogfish's tail. Any questions? What does it want? What did we ever do to it? We have our best people in Woody Intelligence working on that right now. So far, all we know is that the creature's plan somehow revolves around collecting atoms and rockets. What it plans to do with these useless yet abundant natural resources, we have no idea. Our best scientists have been stopped by that very question for decades, and all they've come up with so far is a spacecraft capable of interstellar travel. Why would this interest the furry fiend? Oh, again, we have no idea. Now then, I advise all citizens to remain in their homes until further notice. This meeting is... I should have taken that left turn at Uranus! Was it something I said? What could possibly go wrong? Alright, that was the intro. It takes That took a long time. They have multiplayer on this game. And I have I have no idea what it's about. Let's check the options. Music. Sound effects, voice on and off, credits. Uh, the voice, I imagine it's Bubsy talking. He talks a lot in this game. And it probably gets annoying to some people. That's my first time playing it. I watched a couple of videos on it. I just uh, did a run through of the first level uh, before recording just to get a feel of the game, but it's, the controlling is pretty pretty weird. Alright, here we go. Wow, you're trying to be a video game star. For starters, grab all the items you see. There's plenty of them in each level. And if you get enough of them, you'll be in for some surprises. Some surprises. His, his voice is pretty funny. This game was originally supposed to be developed for 32X. I think that's why it looks so plain. We 
because I think they were probably trying to aim for compatibility on the 32X. And then it got ported over to the PlayStation. And they probably didn't add too much content after that. I think that's why there's a lack, lack of textures <clears throat> and the polygons look really plain. And this controlling is freaking hard. life I'm assuming there's, there's a couple another one up ahead now if you get motion sickness from a 3d game I think this will be the one that'll do it for you <laughs> oh, I that jump. platform I can reach. What's that floating square up there? Let's see if I can... I don't think I can reach that. It looks like outside the level. No, 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 no. I'm trying to see if there's a way to change the camera view. Oh, there is. Maybe that's a secret. Oh, that's like the other side of the level or something. Playing this on the EPSXE emulator uh, version 1.9, I want to say. The thing about using the emulator is you can upscale the graphics. And it looks really a lot, pretty much the best you're gonna get. in front of you? That's a switch! Just run into it to make something cool happen! Which... Uh, this one? I'll open up that one. That wasn't very cool. <laughs> now, if you lose a bumpy, you'll start over here instead of at the beginning of the bubble! Hey, my friend! Enemies! Let's bop them! Let's bop them. <laughs> what the hell? I don't get it. Why am I taking damage? Let's bop them. Come on, big bopper. <laughs> Why is he getting hurt? I don't understand. I thought, I thought those things were checkpoints. Let's try again. He says let's bop him, but is there an attack button I'm not pushing? Uh, no, no control options. Okay, let's just go forward. Forget that guy. Oh, oh, this is my favorite part! Hold the square button when you walk up to an atom! Go ahead, try it! But don't hold it too long! Oh, you can throw them at... That's how you get those guys. You throw the atoms at them. Alright. Ah! The controlling just seems like it's bad just because you gotta play it on a D-pad. I know a lot of people say the controlling is horrible on this game, but... It's... I don't know, I think if they laid out the atoms easier... I mean, the way the controlling is... Like, why is he sliding right there? I don't understand. Why is he sliding? 
Is it because he's running and I suddenly turn? Okay. Oh, see him like run fast for some reason. Let me try throwing an atom at this guy. Ah, there we go. That's how you get enemies. I'll open up this secret area, I think. I can't remember if that was there. I think it was. Music, the music's pretty good. <clears throat> I don't remember playing any of the above Z games, so I'm not even sure what it's supposed to be like. I just always remember it, seeing the artwork and looking at it, but never really that interested to play. Or if I played it, I don't I haven't played it long enough to remember. Okay. Now how am I gonna get on that platform? It seems kinda high. Oh, there we go. The atoms are, I guess, like a replacement for coins. And that's a checkpoint, I'm assuming. That's probably the checkpoint that he was saying. Is it even necessary to kill these guys? Because it'd just be a lot easier to avoid them. Than trying to aim them. Aim at them with an atom. hard like when you push left or right it kind of moves a little bit too far left and right it doesn't seem that it has to be very precise as long as you're in the area so that's good doesn't make it too difficult Necessary to collect all the atoms in this game? I don't be here in a level for a while if it is. If it is necessary, this then this game can be pretty boring. If not, then it's fine. Because it doesn't have much to it, it's very plain. I'm gonna collect all of them for this level and see what it gives you. But I'll try not to do that for all the levels. into the music. <laughs> oh, is it this big platform here? Duh. Or was that already there? Yeah, that, was, that was already, that's where I came from. Alright, let's get these atoms here. Oh, come on! What the hell? this area you kind of like if you run and, and stop for a second he skids let me see like run and then stop yeah but I think if you try to turn another direction it's worse you know 
don't know. I don't know how I skidded so far into the water like that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, now I gotta get onto this platform. Five more, huh? Sounds like a challenge. Sounds like a challenge, Bubsy. <laughs> His voice acting is hilarious. Alright, I think I collected all the atoms. And it gives you a lovely passcode. Game not have memory card save. Good thing for save states. All right. I think all the atoms do is give you points. That's all it looked like it gave me. Missed one rocket. Okay. I think you really have to collect all the rockets. Uh, let's continue the next level. Claustrophobic. Alright. Gotta love the dog barking uh, MIDI effect. things just give me points. I don't even need to collect them. I'm just going to try to pass them all. made it up there. Come on. I <clears throat> got it. Oh, and then you die. Or teleport back. Come on. Get up there. <clears throat> no, get on the platform. I don't even know if this game would be enough exciting to even watch. And there's not much of a new commentary on it's kind of <laughs> it's kind of kind of bland. Damn it! Damn it! Okay. Oh, let's go over here where this little target thing's at. Woo! What a rush! Oh, it's ten atoms. What a rush! Okay, maybe I should just follow the arrows, right? Make easy enough. This way. Oh man. How am I getting hit by these guys? I'm, I need to pay attention. <clears throat> oh, that's how I'm getting hit. How many lives do I 
lives you get. I mean, oh, I got four lives. Okay. Alright, let's just keep passing these others. Yeah, Adam's just giving you points, so what is that gonna do? I'm not trying to go for a high score. Who's gonna wanna go for a high score on this game? <laughs> That's just torture. Whoa, 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 what's that? Get out of there! Oh, come on! Move! Move! Jeez. It's hard to even get out of a place where you got hit from these controls. Okay. How do I get up there? That hurts. Lovely. Why the first level wasn't so hard? Why is this one so difficult all of a sudden? They take time to make different animations for the each death, uh, probably because they figure you're gonna die a lot playing this game. Uh, this level seems pretty big to explore, but I'm not sure. Uh, I wouldn't say this is the worst PlayStation game. Those uh, budget titles that are like ten dollars, that were like ten dollars brand new at the end of the lifespan of the system. Some of those were pretty bad. Some of them were pretty good too. Harder 
extremely suck at it. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna start try to start taking out enemies to go a little bit slower. I think I'm just rushing through it too quick. Aiming isn't so hard. When I first started, I thought it was going to be really difficult, but it kind of give you a, a, a little leeway. Like uh, it doesn't have to be exactly right. In the, in the <clears throat> now you just don't want to fall off of this because I don't even know where you start. How I even got here. Checkpoint here? Is that what that is? Yeah. I'm assuming that's the checkpoint. And a rocket. There's that rocket. Yeah, me too. Alright, let's see if I can reach that. Oh, that was horrible. I don't even know if it's possible to reach that platform. Oh, yeah, at least we found one of the rockets. Start picking out some enemies here. It seemed like when I was holding that, that even though I was getting, if I got hit, would have gotten hit. Um, since I'm holding the atom, I don't get hit. That's that's pretty nice. <laughs> well, you're safe while you're holding the atom, but. said not to hold it too long. Apparently I, it doesn't go over this little hump there, so. Oh, that was This is getting ridiculous. I wonder if I throw one of the atoms at this, uh, the power thing, but there's so many bad guys here. Oh! It comes back to <laughs> it comes back and hits you. That's pretty funny. Oh man! I think that's the end. I hope you know what you're doing. Okay, I only have one more life left, and I forgot to sa no, I safe stated uh, at the beginning of this level. That's cool. Kills all enemies. That's what I was trying to get last time when I died. See right there, the running. I tried to stop. I was scared. Huh. Tap back. He does like a hop. That's probably how it would get to that next platform. I didn't think about that. Doesn't seem, doesn't seem like he jumps as far though when he gets trying to. Like I almost feel he can jump farther without gliding. Okay. I'm gonna try to glide slightly farther. That's probably how I would have been able to get to that platform that I missed. After I got the rocket. <clears throat> got a duck. You d oh, okay. You can try ducking. Looks like he's dancing. <laughs> I 
ducks. The music, the music's hilarious. Actually, the music seems really quiet on this game compared to the most games. Touched this, I died. So I'm gonna touch it now that the sun's not there. See what happens. Oh man, that's crap. Oh, I know. What if I glide over this? Duh. Let's try it. And there we go. Making some progress. Let's see how I say I should always learn the controls before I start games, but I don't learn my lesson. <laughs> been actually pretty easy if I figured it out from the beginning. Alright, stage three. Alright, I'm gonna try stage three. Loading is actually pretty fast on this game. Surprising. Probably because there isn't much to load. Anymore. What the hell? How'd that happen? Eat it. Oh, that's pretty cool. It's gonna bounce back. <laughs> Serious? I can't even really tell that this is moving. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to jump from here. I guess under this one. Yeah. Okay, okay, back up, back up. It's hard to uh, measure the distance between the platforms. It's kind of good that it changes overhead view while you're jumping, at least you can measure it like you're in mid-air to try to adjust your jump. 
It's actually not really that. It's not really that hard as it looks. Like, yeah, I die when. But it's not really that hard. You know what you're doing. It looks a lot worse. glide right here to make this one. Is this platform even moving? It's not moving. I thought I was moving the whole time. Alright, we're trying gliding. Oh, why is he doing that? What the hell? Why is he... Oh, I pushed the wrong button. I freaking pushed the duck. I'm going to end the video here, and then I'll part two, I'll continue from this level.